You may have heard that Microsoft is coming out with new keyboards for Windows 11 that have a brand new AI button. So I guess we just have to throw out all of our old keyboards. Unless you have something like the Logitech G915, where we can easily program our own AI button. So this keyboard has some built-in shortcut keys that we can assign to whatever we want. So just like the new keyboards that bring out Copilot with their AI button, we can program the same thing on our G915 using Logitech G Hub. So open G Hub, select the keyboard, come to assignments, select macros. Now the keyboard shortcut to open Copilot is Windows C, and that works on any keyboard, but we're going to turn that into a single key. I think I'll use G5. So go to create new macro, name it AI or Copilot, whatever you prefer, select no repeat. Click Start Now, choose Record Strokes, press Windows and C, and then Release, Stop Recording, Save, and then drag the macro to your key of choice. I'm gonna use G5, and that's it. Now when I press G5, the AI side panel opens, and I can ask it whatever I want. I can hit G5 again, and that will close the AI. Now, if you don't have a keyboard that has built-in macro keys, you can always use the Windows C shortcut or go to the Microsoft Store and download Power Toys, and that will let you create macro keys on any keyboard. Well, I mean, maybe not that one. So there's no need to wait until the new keyboards are released, and there's no reason to get rid of a keyboard that you already have and like. Simply program your own AI button, and welcome to the future.